Uh, 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 <coughs> I can't do it right now. What is happening, fellow collectors, fellow subscribers, fellow hunters? It's a beautiful morning, isn't it, Chucky? Yeah. Got the figs all perfectly lined up today. Today we are expected to have Black Panther arrive in the Amazon package at the door so I can add him to the shelf. Um, but you know, to get this day started, we're gonna go get some breakfast. You know they don't talk back, right? We're gonna go get some Denny's, you guys. We're starving. It's, it's been a while since we got some Denny's breakfast and we're starving, so we're gonna go do that. Yeah, yeah we're gonna go do that. Ooh, my goodness. You gotta have your Cholula sauce, a little bit of ketchup too. You gotta start it off with the yerba mate. Avocado drops right on my pan. Are you serious? Oh, I'm full. You full? You more than full? Look at my belly. I'm like Humpty Dumpty. Well, that was a nice hearty breakfast. I didn't even finish the other half of my sandwich. Michael's gonna give it away to a homeless person. Sure. If we find a homeless guy and he looks pretty hungry, yeah, I'll give him the sandwich. Learn, man. Learn. Open the door for your woman. I opened the door for you last night. <laughs> twice. I know, I'm just kidding. Okay. What are you saying? What was yeah, I saying? Yeah, no one cares. <laughs> We're in the talks right now of what kind of truck we want me to get by the end of hopefully next year. My little Nissan Maxima, I'm about a thousand dollars left to paying it off. And after that, I need a truck, okay? I miss having a truck, my good old Ford F-150, uh, Hunter, Mobile, I loved it, man. It was, uh, I could do anything I want with it. If I wanted to haul some stuff, I could haul some stuff. Mike the Hunter needs a truck. I was thinking of um, <clears throat> a Tacoma or a, a new Hyundai Santa Cruz, which is pretty small on the inside. Look, oh at those. Look at that Jeep, look at that Jeep right there. Oh, yes. Chevy Colorados. Oh, oh look, my. there's some here. Gosh, look at this Chevy. I need a Chevy. Oh. I need a Chevy or a Toyota Tacoma so I can do big boy things in my big boy truck, brothers. Other than that, we're just going around doing Drink some gas. doing some hobby stuff and um, waiting for my Black Panther to come in the mail because it said it was coming from Amazon today. And who got you a Black Panther? Mary got me a Black Panther for an early Christmas gift. I said, babe, that's the only figure that's missing on my Avenger shelf right now. I want the brand new Black Panther with the pinstripes. If you can just get me that, I will be the happiest man on this earth. I'm just waiting for it to come in the mail so I can unbox it with you guys and pose it up and put it on the shelf. How do you feel about the new improved Mike the Hunter collection? Tell him, hon. Tell him, tell him how you feel. It looks the same, you just bought little things to stand him up on. It does not look the same. It does not look even remotely the same as it was before. <laughs> it looks so much better, so much more organized. Every character gets and to I shine. And I keep telling them, what did I keep telling you to put the, f to buy that glue thing? She wants me to use putty for my figures, guys. That is a cowardly move. I will not do it. The day I use putty is the day I give up on my own balancing skills when it comes to posing my action figures, all right? If you can't balance your action figures in a good pose, go to the putty, that's okay. But me, I still want to balance my figures. No, because they're just gonna keep falling. When we open the door, they're just gonna keep falling and then I'm gonna hear you every day complain. There's nothing wrong with my posing. It's the fact that you and Chloe open the door like you're the damn police. And the door slams to the are. wall, and then the figures are like, and then they fall down. All right, folks, we are finally here to present this beauty that took a week to get delivered by Amazon. Now, obviously, Amazon's got, you know, they're caught up in some shit right now. They're trying to get all these rush deliveries out. I finally have the newest Black Panther uh, from Hasbro, which I'm excited to have this one. This one looks pretty sweet just from the box. The pinstripes on his gloves, on his boots. I love the gray that he has on his gloves and boots. 
This is actually my first Black Panther uh, that I own that in includes a cape, so that's going to be pretty cool. I'm not too interested in the Build-A-Figure, don't really care for it. Other than the Mojo that I unboxed, um, this is the first Marvel Legend that I've had in this type of box. Uh, th that doesn't have the plastic that we're used to. Mike the Hunter, what were your thoughts on the Black Panther movie? Obviously it was not the same uh, without Chadwick Boseman, we all know that. Rest in peace to the legend. But overall the movie was, it was alright, like I liked it, uh, it was still funny, it had some funny moments. I liked the way they introduced Namor, he was a pretty cool character. Um, and I liked how Shuri took over the mantle of Black Panther, her suit looked pretty sweet, so... Let's get you a quick look at the box before I tear it open, you got some uh, Black Panther art there on the side. Build a figure, uh, another picture of the figure back there. And another thing that they don't do anymore, which is uh, pretty lame, Hasbro, you guys don't write the origins on the back. What are we doing, folks? Let's get the origin stories back on. Now, you know, we all like reading them. It gets us excited and amped to open the figure. Let's just hope that we don't get a faulty figure with no you know, bad paint applications or any defects. Wow, <sighs> man. This is weird. What is this? Oh, the Build-A-Figure piece uh, wrapped in toilet paper. So weird. It comes in like a little secure, like a roller coaster secure thing. You know what I'm talking about? Like you go on Tatsu at Six Flags and like, all right guys, we're gonna strap you in this thing. What is that? Wow. Just looking at the cape from the back. I love it. Look how it's like blowing in the wind just right. I love the head sculpt, I love the cape, I love the matte black looking really good, the gloves, the hands going down, look at these ninja toes. You can't go wrong with those. And he is pinless, there are no pins on his leg or his arms, I love that. Hasbro, I'm glad you guys are doing that now. Also we have the double jointed elbows. One thing I was excited to try with this figure was the Black Panther pose, but uh, doesn't look like we can, so that sucks. I might I might have to learn how to do it with this legend. Yeah, you can. That's like the closest I can get. I'm super excited to have this one. I think this is... Uh, wait a minute! Oh, hell no! Look at this beautiful sculpted and painted eye. And then look at this shit. What is that? Can you guys see it? I don't know if you could see it with the light. Kind of screwed me over with this eyeball over here. It's partially painted. Part of the eye, they did not paint it. Uh, I'm at least gonna try to fix that with uh It looks like it could match perfectly with a silver Sharpie. At least tell me you guys can hardly notice it in the comments, so that makes me feel better. This is exactly why we don't like the new packaging, you a-holes, because we don't know what we're getting. All right, so before we add them to the shelf, we gotta get some lights, camera, action uh, with this new Black Panther and get him in a sweet pose, get him in, uh, in a nice little diorama setting, maybe some lighting. Lights, camera, action. So we got just a kind of a Wakanda setting here. Kind of looks funky with video because the screen is, you know, glitching out in the back. But uh, yeah, guys, I'm gonna try to get a solid photo of him here with the TV. Um, I'm still like, you know, getting used to how to do this shit. There might be a few things that I can do to make this look 100%, but I am learning, so. Yeah. So I went ahead and added Black Panther to the Marvel Legends hero shelf, right, with the rest of the Avengers. But I think it'd be nice to get like a black uh, marker, a very fine point one, and fill in those lines. I think that would give it a lot more detail. But overall, he is right where he belongs.
And I know this isn't the best pose. Like I said, I really wanted to get him in the like uh, the cross arms Wakanda Forever pose, but like even with the butterfly joints, I can't manage to get it. So if anyone knows how to do it, hey, send me a picture on Instagram of, of the way you posed your Black Panther. Uh, maybe I can get some ideas from you guys. But uh, for now, I'll leave him here ready to attack. With that being said, folks, I hope you enjoy your figs. I hope you enjoy your families. And as always... Good hunting. Peace. Peace.